so hi today we are going to check the water flows in postman so here is my collection sample api this here are different apis so we need to create a flow so firstly this is one api the set aws credential in this api in the test part we can execute we can set variables like this uh, the environment variables here so i have set some environment variables here if we check here access key and these are the two environments first is a global and second is flows environment so here i am setting it okay so this is the flows part so he, from here we can create flow so one thing i need to tell you about flows is like when you run anything when you run any request on flows so it will not set the environment variable or it will not run the test script uh, what does that mean is like whenever we run that this api this is my body and then after completion of uh, the successful response the, this this part is going to set if we run it normally but in flows this will not set so if we are calling if we are creating any flow Okay, let me delete it again so what i'm going to tell you is like send request we will set the environment so when we run this flow it will not set the say, uh, uh, set the uh, environment variables with the latest value it will be only Mm, the scope will be only for this flow and it will uh, you can access that response but you, you can't set the configuration variables so we will connect this response to an api different api that is send request uh, we will connect it to the state customers flows okay So how we are going to access the data from this API okay so this is where you can access so we will go here firstly we will do this JSON here also like here we can do this yes JSON then we can assign values to variable so firstly I will show you this get customer API get customer API in the authorization authorization we are passed this access key secret key that we are going to set so this is the flow okay we need to assign values to variables session token so here it is not so it is not showing anything in this body uh, because it 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 doesn't know what is will be the response so so for that we should run it once so we'll cancel it we'll run it once we'll so the entire flow is running okay now you will get the values session token inside variables body session token secret key secret key now we have set this so if this color is red then the, you need to like start start it like one two times or there is some issue here so this is the console of postman so we'll clear it and we'll check if the date response from this request is uh, is what is going to send in this response in this request so let's start the flow see this is one gws api 
so here we are getting access key this is the secret key and this should be passed in the authorization header of the second request because that's what we have done so we will test for access key this is asia 3u cj copy this now we will check here see this is the same secret key that is going so and this is the same security token if you check this is the security key and this is a security token iqu okay see this is the same so this is how we can pass data from one request to say another request and close okay thank you for watching this video